Welcome back to another cooler review. This is the Coho 30 can cooler by Costco. Uh, at least that's where I purchased my cooler at Costco for $49.99. So initially, this is um, kind of similar to what I bought at home, I'm sorry, at Walmart, the 30 can, the um, Ozark Trail. But a little different style. So I like this style here because you can use it as a beach bag and a cooler. On the outside, it's just a looks like a heavy duty vinyl nothing fancy there's a couple zippers here one zipper right here for your phone maps whatever to keep things dry and of course you have your main zipper right here it does say that this, the zippers are waterproof sealed there's lots of handles there's this two long handles here it does come with a shoulder strap and also a carry handle on each side as you see here there's some places to hang whatever you want here i'm not sure what you would hang there but you can hang whatever if you're that kind of guy that likes to have carabiners around everywhere. Um, let's take a quick look at some of the specs here. Okay. Uh, so this have a food grade. Okay. Anyways, let's open this bag up here. Okay, when you step back, you should get a kind of a perspective of how big this thing is um, like I said it's generally kind of big enough to hold 30 cans anyways so what I want to do today is go down to the my local store go buy a bag of ice stuff it in there and see how long it lasts all right all right so we got seven pounds of ice seven pounds okay. open this bad boy up Okay, so about 12 bottles of water and seven, seven pounds of ice. That filled up almost halfway there. So here we go. So I do want to reiterate here is that I know that this ice would hold much longer if I was to pre-chill all my drinks, you know, and also chill down my bag as well with some sacrificial ice and all that BS that I don't ever do. I'm not sure really who does, except for if you're planning a long expedition, for example. But um, like I said, this is a uh, rare item right out of my garage. Everything is room temperature. Throw some cold drinks in here, and, and I just want to see how long the ice holds up, how long my how long my drinks stay cold. Um, so here we go. It's under the clock right now. Roughly, actually, it's almost uh, what three? It's three o'clock. Okay, so as you can see, the shoulder is nice. Uh, the shoulder strap is nice and big, so you can throw over your shoulder. Throw the bag back here. Okay. Okay, so it's been about five hours i think so it's, it's 8 30 right now so 3 30 4 30 5 30 6 30 7 30 8 30 five hours and let's see let's check in on the ice and see how this cooler is doing okay well there's still some ice which is good i would say there's about also there's about five percent ice left in here but um yeah 95 percent of it has melted away but the cold but it's still cold in there it's got to be at least 30 some degrees so that's good kept my lunch or whatever snacks cold so yeah you know i guess it did what i expected i didn't expect this to last more than really eight hours today and in about three hours i would think this would all be melted but the cooler's still cold um so i think it did its job for the price, 50 bucks, you can't expect much. But what I wanted to do here is test the waterproofing and see how good that is. So let me go ahead and zip this up. Okay, I would say that zipped up pretty good, right? Okay, let's get back to the video here. My neighbor just stopped by to say hello. But we were looking at the waterproofing, see how well this held up in case this, for example, uh, flipped over like this and see if there's anything leaking. 
And I was saying earlier, I didn't see anything leaking, but let's look, take a look at the zipper here. And yeah, I think this, this looks really good. I'm really surprised for a $50 uh, uh, cooler that it's not only waterproof on the, I think on the outside, but also the inside. So that's good. So anyways, I hope you guys uh, enjoyed this quick video and hope that it was helpful. Um, if you think about getting a $50 cooler to cool your drinks and lunch for whatever for five to eight hours, I think this is a good choice. If you're looking for anything longer than that to keep your food and drinks cold, then I would suggest something different. Again, stay cool and we'll see you later.